Hey guys, welcome back to Java Collections Framework Series. In this video, we will create a ArrayList class example 2 to demonstrate how to create a ArrayList from another collection. Okay, let's switch to the Eclipse ID and let's create this example. In pre previous example, I have demonstrated how to create a ArrayList using ArrayList constructor and how to add a new elements to the ArrayList using add method. Okay, now I will see how to create a list from another collection for that i'm going to create a new class let's give a class name as create a list from collection example okay and quickly create a main method great we'll see two ways we can create a list from another collection first we'll see how to create a list from another collection using array list constructor and second way how to add all the elements from existing collection to new array list using add on method okay so these are the two ways we can you know create array list from another collection let me demonstrate both the ways let's go ahead and let's create array list class object first create array list class object okay now we are going to store first five prime numbers in an array list for that let's go ahead and let's use a list interface as a reference type and here we are going to use an integer wrapper class to store prime numbers so i already uh, you know mentioned like array list don't support uh, primitive types so we have to use wrapper classes right so here I have used integer wrapper class in order to store uh, primitive integer. Okay, great. Now let's give a reference variable name as first five prime numbers, new and then array list. Okay, let's go ahead and let's add first five prime numbers to the list. Let's use add method. To, let me copy this line of code and paste it here 3 and this is 5 and this is 7 and this is 11 okay now we have created a list with first 5 prime numbers now we're gonna add this list to the other list for example now what I will do I will create a one more array list object here let's call it as first 10 prime numbers and then new and here I'm going to use array list and look at here this is the important so I'm going to use constructor array list and here I want to pass a collection as a parameter to the array list constructor right so let's go ahead and let's choose this array list constructor okay. and here we can pass this list to the constructor array list constructor like this okay so this is how we can create a array list from another collection okay so look at here array list uh, constructor has a parameter collection because array list internally implements list interface and list interface extends collection interface so here we have given a super type as a parameter okay so don't get confused array list internally implements list interface and list interface internally extends collection interface so that's why we always prefer to provide uh, you know super class or super interface as a parameter all right guys now we have added this array list to this array list now we'll create one more array list which has next five prime numbers and then we'll add that next five prime numbers to this list okay let's go ahead and let's create a list and pass integer as a type and let's say a reference type as next five prime numbers and then array list let's use a default constructor 
and let's go ahead and let's add next five prime numbers dot add uh, 13 okay and let me copy this line of code paste it here and let's change the values 17 and 19 and then 23 and one more 29 so these are the next five prime numbers now I want to add these next five prime numbers to the array list object that is first 10 prime numbers right so let's go ahead and let's let's use this object and call add all method okay add all and this add all method accepts collection object as a parameter so let's go ahead and let's pass next five num prime numbers to the add all method okay now if you look at here we created first five prime numbers and then we have added this first five five prime numbers to the first 10 prime numbers object and then later we have created next five prime numbers and then we have added these next five prime numbers to the first 10 five numbers now this object first 10 five prime numbers contains all right 10 prime numbers now we can go ahead and we can print the result of this object and you can able to see 10 prime numbers all right put the sys out system dot out dot print ln and just pass this object and let's go ahead and let's run the program yeah here we go you can able to see 10 prime numbers so this array list object contains 10 prime numbers all right guys this is how you know we can create array list from another collection using array list constructor this is array list parameterized constructor and this is how we can uh, create array list uh, from another collection using add all method okay all right guys that's all about this example i will see you in the next array list class example